All right, so we have here a PC. An invisible one. Shit, here we go. We'll do a live repair of it, see what we can do. Make some room. <gasps> oh, that's me. And this is heavy, even without the hard drives in it. So, wrong way around. <laughs> oh, shish. Okay. So, they said it was idling uh, one day and came to use it, it worked and simply watch the video or something and then turned off had to fiddle around to see if they can fix it before bringing it to me and they said no, nah, don't worry about it let's just take it to someone else, okay Astrox Z370 Pro 4 oh there's two hard drives here there is an SSD by Samsung with a white sticker on it bunch of RAMs let's have a look at the behavior and see what's going on be quiet uh, power supply power on any lights, any activities and nothing press the power button nothing, okay currently on but nothing on the power supply that's the wrong one okay let's have a look at in so we're in switch mode okay we don't need that schematics have a look in voltage mode Finally, uh, we're in voltage mode. Can't even tell what color is what. Okay, uh, let's bring in a generic power supply cable. it goes this way so that one there should be negative yep correct okay. okay so what have we got in terms of voltages 0 0.06 the yellow ones mm, 0 .06. Seven and the purple. Purple has five volts. Okay, I'm normally sure it's the green one. It's coming from this side. Should be the fourth one. Or the orange one has nothing. Purple or blue, which is second. That's four three. Next one should be ground. And the next one is our power button. jumped over to the other camera okay so here is the power button which is one two three four has zero point zero five let's get the power power is off press the power button a few times okay recharging up the capacitors maybe power on here we go, 5 volts, okay, that's the power button, I'm going to press it, and it drops, interesting, so 
So there's an internal short on the motherboard. Okay. So in this case, most likely the power supply is fine. Let's take the GPU out. Okay. Power button. Yep. Same stereo. Power off. Let's start with the elephant in the room. See you later. Okay. Oh, there's only one screw, okay, interesting. Just checking the visual visual damages there on the uh, power supply of the GPU in tired mode. Let's see what's going on. So no shortage on 12 volt rail of the power supply of the graphic card. Put it on the side. Okay, let's try turning it on now one more time. Remove all the probes. Okay. Power button on. Nothing. eliminate some of the easiest to identify components so USB ports front and the audio and power buttons the fans fans let's get rid of some fans okay that's about it and this fan too power on we just got the motherboard on with SATA data cables and the power and audio uh, reset and hard drive activity lights cables are on power button fan spun a little bit if you did see that here we go one more time Interesting, okay. Uh, let's take this guy out to try. I don't think we need to try a different power supply because I doubt that's the problem. But easiest thing we can try. Without going mental. By the way, I don't like that card. That's the um, TP-Link card there. Okay, there's a TP-Link card there, and I don't like that one. It's usually a sign of problems.
Okay, that's in. Now let's try the power cable here on the new power supply. Here we go. Get an overview. Power button. Boom. Any lights, activities, nothing. Out of curiosity, before we turn it on, see if the USB port has an active. Yeah, it's got a 5 port there, 5 volt there. Yep, try everywhere. So no short on like USB power ports and power button. Turns on, okay. Interesting. Okay, so most likely it's in a power supply, eh? Let's reconnect some of these components. Okay. And then... Pretty much everything is connected except the GPU. Okay, turn it on again. All right. All right. It still may not be the case. It could be a problem with these um, SSDs or hard drives. So what we should do, ideally, somehow, this cable management is going to the back. A quick way to test will be take these guys out. Okay, we've taken our power supply out. open up the other side of the tower okay I'm just gonna disconnect the SSD and the two hard drive power supplies because that's the only other two are connected and that's the only two difference. There's also a couple of, what are these, fans. That's okay. There is a power supply for a fan module. Disconnect that too. Okay. Basically, we're creating the same scenario as what is on the other power supply I've just tested. So now we're going to connect back the old power supply. Okay, they're all in. There we go, let's try this now. Power is currently off. No, same shit. Okay. We can rule definitely the issue is, is with the uh, power supply. Or I'll give the quotation. Um. I'll give the quotation to the client, see what they want to do. I'll pause the video for now. Yeah, so that's about it for this. And your power supply should fix it. Do some cable management and happy days. So for now, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.